We definitely are better together, that's a fact, but I took this one solo. Hey, we are That Rogers Family and our goal is to encourage, inspire, and empower you to do family on purpose. We definitely are better together, that's a fact, but I took this one solo. Who's gonna pack up the car? Somebody! <laughs> Anybody! So she headed all the way down from Northern California, all the way down to Southern California to celebrate my brother-in-law, her brother, ordination, congratulations Brian, and also the birthday of Peyton. She turned two years old, I couldn't believe it. The kids did a pretty good job. We moved Zeke's seat next to Faith so that she could kind of entertain him and feed him and that made a big difference. Also a game changer was I brought Ellie's training toilet so we could just pull off on the side of the road and use it if we want. And a little pro tip, if you stick an empty diaper in the bottom of the toilet, then you don't have a mess to clean up. The front end and the back end of the trip we tagged onto Mimi's house just to give us a place to spend the night, to regroup, brought Mimi and Papa into the minivan and down to SoCal we went. Service. We're sitting in there, I was enjoying the service, no kids, kid free, service enjoyment, and then I get a text on my phone that says, could Ezekiel be hungry? He's fussing a lot. They had already gotten through the worship and they were about to start honoring the ordination candidates oh, wow. and I got the text. So a couple weeks ago I talked about uh, my licensing as a pastor and that's kind of like the mid-level. Well, my brother-in-law Brian, congratulations, he got ordained. Brian Rankin. So one of the main reasons Brian is pursuing ordination is so he can be an army chaplain. And so he's worked really hard, so congratulations. Yeah, he's on his way to becoming an army chaplain. He's just waiting on the army. So do you guys remember a couple weeks ago when Nehemiah said this? All right, I'll video and do your wedding. <laughs> I will vlog, uh, marry you. Well, apparently someone took him up on it. Yes, I got to go there and I officiated a wedding, uh, but naturally I had to bring my camera. Super nervous, I got my iPad and my script, uh, but it's gonna go good, I'm sure. Uh, thank you, Taylor and Bianca, for this opportunity. It's gonna be a great time. This is my first wedding. Oh! So, Taylor said to me when he heard that, it's mine too, so thank you, Taylor and Bianca. Go ahead and have a done, I got the paperwork here, I'm gonna sign for them. They're gonna come take some pictures, but I thought it went really smooth. Uh, it was a lot of fun, so. And they were really proud of me because they knew it was my first time, and uh, I was, you know, happy for them. It's just a neat uh, perspective that I've never seen before. So thank you for trusting me. I had a great time at your wedding. We went to the Long Beach Aquarium, the Aquarium of the Pacific, and it was so much fun. I actually walked in there and realized I had been there before because they have this massive whale that if you've seen wow. it before you won't. You will remember. <laughs> you will be like, oh, I have been here. So the first thing we did and something I would definitely recommend at the Aquarium of the Pacific was the lorikeet habitat. But if you buy little nectar things, you can hold them and the birds will come and land on you. Oh no. <laughs> I know. I really expected the kids to freak out a little bit more. Uh -huh. 
but I don't know if it was because it was the first thing we did and it was like a whirlwind. Usually we try to build our kids up to the big things. Yes. Birds were landing on people's heads. <laughs> Ellie and Faith both held a bird, which was cool. Yeah. I was proud of them, and I had fun. I really like animals, she like does. a lot. So this kind of stuff, it may have been Peyton's birthday party, but it might as well have <laughs> been mine. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us here at the Aquarium of the Pacific today. You could go into this little tunnel and there's a big part where you can see all the penguins but you can also go into this tunnel and the penguins can swim up above you and the light was shining through and sparkling on the ground. The kids loved it. It was bigger and better than I remember, probably because I had kids. I feel like everything's better with kids. Yes, you get to experience the second time. Yeah. We had a lot of fun at the Long Beach Aquarium. We have kind of started this tradition that for second birthdays, we go somewhere and we have a party in a hotel. Yeah, that's true. All three of them. So Peyton continued the, the hotel party, two-year-old tradition, with a Paw Patrol party. Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, be Never. there on the double. So the girls got to help decorate for Peyton's party, and Ezekiel got to play with the balloons, and we got to surprise her for her second birthday party in the hotel room. Oh! That's right. Yeah. Surprise! Say surprise! Surprise! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! So we had a nice little movie night in the hotel room. Mimi brought tons of snacks, as usual, and we partied until bedtime. Party time. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Peyton! Peyton. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. So Bakersfield, if you didn't know, is super hot all the time. In the summer especially, it's like 100 degrees. So she loves the heat. The kids got a chance to go swimming. She has a pool for basically every kid. So we have the big pool for the adults, the, the built-in pool for mm -hmm. the adults. And then we have what she calls Big Blue, which is more for like Faith and Ellie. And then we have Baby Blue, which is for Peyton, our niece. And then she has the little splash pad for Ezekiel. She has all these pools out. Then she's like a hoarder of inflatables. And for whatever reason, when the kids come out to play, she feels the need to inflate all the toys for the kids. <laughs> So they had lots of choices on how to play in the water, and I could not get them out of the water.
Mimi's and in Southern California, and it was a great road trip. Oh, so for our round trip road trip yeah. stats, we went 857 miles in the car. Wow. And we spent 16 hours and 44 minutes driving. And you did awesome. And you're a champion. You're an awesome. Champion. <laughs> Faith, really, you have a good mothering, nurturing heart. You take really good care of Ezekiel on our road trip. So thanks for that. Because these guys are a lot of work, but I need my wife. It was a long trip. They're home. I'm glad they're safe. That's right. That's right. Okay, we'll see you next week for Ezekiel's birthday. Yes, it's pretty specifically exciting. Specifically, an army chaplain. Armly, army. Armly. Armly. Oh, he's gonna be an armly chaplain. <laughs>